let's understand a little more about types of assets. In the last video, we discussed that assets are basically of two types, organic assets and mineral assets. Okay. Now, organic acid basically are the acid which are naturally found or they naturally occur. Just like we discussed about the citric acid in lemon. So you naturally found them. You don't need to kind of do anything to create these kinds of acids. Okay. Similarly, another example is very common example is lactic acid. Where is it found? It is found in milk. So these are naturally occurring acids that we find in our day to day uses. Okay. Now, these kinds of acid are weak acids. Now, what do I mean by weak acids? Weak acids basically what I mean by that is that when you eat, stroke, drink them, they are not harmful. I mean, you normally drink milk. Is it harmful? No. We have lemon in our food. Is it harmful? No. Similarly, you have oranges. When you eat oranges, is it harmful? No. Even though it contains all these organic acids, they are not harmful because they are weak acid. They do not cause any problem when one eats or drinks them. Let's move on to the second category, which is the mineral acid. Now, mineral acids are the one which are prepared from minerals found on earth. So, these are prepared. These are not found. Unlike a lemon juice or lemon citric acid that you find in a lemon, these acids are not found. They are prepared from the minerals on the earth. Sometimes these mineral acids are also known as laboratory acids. Okay, because they are prepared in the laboratory. An example first is the hydrochloric acid. Okay, now hydrochloric acid, what is it used for? You clean your kitchen stroke washrooms using this acid okay second could be sulfuric acid now sulfuric acid is used to make the car batteries etc okay so this is what is forming part of the mineral acids okay now these mineral acids, unlike organic acids, are not weak. They are strong. Now what do you mean by strong? You can't hold on to sulfuric acid in your hand because it might burn your hand. Okay? So therefore, these acids have to be handled with extreme care and caution, otherwise it can be physically damaging. So one needs to take care of all these things.